Hi guys, Bob for Bob's Movie Review here, and today I'm bringing you a new Blu-ray and DVD shopping guide for Tuesday, September 27th, 2016. Alright guys, before we get into this one, it's pretty short anyway, so the video should be pretty short. If you don't want to listen to what I have to say, everything is available down in the description. You guys can find all the prices and everything down there. So, I think from this point going forward, I'm going to try to cut back on the movie purchases. I really don't have the money, I need to pay off some bills, and I really don't have the time to watch all these movies. I've been lately just like, I don't know, just really behind on everything, and I, f I feel like my channel is not really where I want it to be. It, it's like, you know, a lot of YouTube is personality, and maybe I just don't have a good personality to do these kind of videos. Um, you know, you see some crap out there, that it's like super popular and I feel like my videos are alright are all right, you know but uh, I put up a graphic the other day um, on Facebook and I could share that with you guys um, I need to find it first forgot to get it up but only like 22% of my total watch time is from subscribers and um, I don't know that's, that's pretty disappointing to me that you know my subscribers aren't even supporting my videos like I feel like I give a lot to my subscribers and so I think um, I think we're gonna do a different format with giveaways I'm not sure how I'm gonna do giveaways anymore um, yeah 22.2 percent of my watch time is from this is the last 28 days from subscribers and 77.8 from non-subscribers now I know there are uh, some people out there who are really supporting this channel and I appreciate that guys I'm never talking about you but um, I don't know if if like people who are subscribed and everything they just click on the giveaway videos and then they just they, they know to look for that link and they go to the giveaway um, but I do a lot of giveaways to give back and who am I giving back to you know what I mean so I'm not sure exactly what I want to do there but I, I do know that um, you know the way I tried to run my channel at least was that I would I would bring you guys like information about the upcoming releases and then I would try to show you guys the new releases and then I would review them but lately I've really just dropped off on the reviews I just haven't been watching movies I did recently record um, Out of the Shadows review Neighbors 2 review I gotta record my Conjuring review but I, I, also, I also feel like reviews are like my weakest uh, videos I make and I I don't know. I, maybe I need to go go back and look at that and see how I do that, and maybe try to put a little more into it and make them a little better, so you guys will enjoy them a little more. But I think that definitely for now, I I need to quit buying just every movie that comes out. And you know, sometimes I justified, you know, that I, I want to buy a movie so that I can show it to you guys, and it's just it's too expensive to be doing that. So. Um, Definitely, like, I was going to get, like, everything that was coming out this week, but I decided to just wait. You know, movies drop in price pretty quick, and, you know, if I really want something, I'll pick it up. And I'm definitely still going to get steel books. Of course, I have to have those. <laughs> um, but I think that this is a good thing for me for now to uh, just reduce the total amount of movies I'm getting. And I have, like, 500 movies to watch at least, you know. So I'm, I'm not saying, like, I'm stopping my channel or anything. I'm just going to kind of reevaluate how I'm doing things and I'm going to I'm going to change some stuff up definitely. Um, so first movie we have this week is Central Intelligence and I thought this one looked pretty interesting. I always liked The Rock. Kevin Hart is kind of iffy for me. Uh, it's rated PG-13 with an hour and 47 minute runtime. This is an action com comedy crime movie with a 6.4 rating. I always I always kind of wondered if they didn't call it Central Intelligence Agency like because it's like some sort of copyright or I don't even know what you'd call it or if it's just because they didn't want you to necessarily like the central intelligence that's funnier you know how that works uh, after he reconnects with an awkward pal from high school through Facebook a mild-mannered accountant is lured into the world of international espionage like I said uh, Dwayne Johnson and Kevin Hart uh, this one's gonna get a couple releases first off it has a 4k blu-ray and digital HD 4K, Blu-ray, and Digital HD combo pack. Amazon, Best Buy, Target, and Walmart, all $29.99. Has a Blu-ray and Digital HD combo pack. 
Amazon Best Buy and Target $22.99, and Walmart $24.96. We'll also be releasing on a DVD, Amazon and Walmart $17.95, Best Buy and Target $17.99. Next up, we have another one that I, I was pretty interested in seeing called The Shallows, rated PG-13 with an hour and 26 minute runtime. This is a drama horror thriller with 6.5 out of 10 rating on IMDb. A mere 200 yards from shore, surfer Nancy is attacked by a great white shark, and her short journey to safety becomes the ultimate contest of wills. So if you guys haven't seen the trailer, basically this girl's out surfing, a shark attacks her. I don't, I don't think she's like can't remember if it bit her or didn't bite her or what, but she basically gets on this rock and it, you can see land and the shark is just like circling her. And so, I mean, eventually she has to try to get back to safety. Not sure, you know, obviously what happens since I haven't seen it. Uh, it, has, it stars Blake Lively. Uh, this one again will have a couple releases here. We got 4K and Blu-ray. Now, I didn't see any of these editions being advertised as coming with a digital HD. It, might not it might i don't know they, they want to advertise so um and also i could not find this movie on the walmart.com website i'm sure they're gonna have this movie in stores but they only were listing for their voodoo version or whatever could not find the actual physical copy so uh 4k and blu-ray edition will be 26.99 at amazon and target and 27.99 at best buy the blu-ray version will be 19.99 at amazon best buy and target and the DVD version will be $16.99 at Amazon and Target and $17.99 at Walmart. Now the movie you've all been waiting for, the very long awaited, Warcraft, the movie. <laughs> um, let's see, sorry, I'm on the wrong thing here. Uh, this one is rated PG-13 with 123 minute runtime. This is an action adventure fantasy. Um, with a 7.2 rating on IMDb, how can it be rated so high? I heard this movie is terrible and nobody saw it. It only had, literally, this movie already went through theaters and it only has 808 user reviews. Only 136,899 people have voted on a rating. That's probably everybody who saw it. As an orc horde invades the planet Azeroth using a magical portal, a few human heroes are dissenting, and dissenting orcs must attempt to stop the true evil behind this war. I don't even... I didn't think this has like any famous voices in it. I don't know. I heard I heard the movie was terrible. Um, so this one has a few releases. Go over them real quick. Uh, has a 4K Blu-ray Blu-ray digital HD combo pack. Um, Amazon and Target 26.99, Walmart 27.96, and Best Buy 27.99. A 3D Blu-ray Blu-ray digital HD combo pack. Amazon and Best Buy $27.99. I could not find this listed on the Target website and Walmart $29.99. So I find it interesting that the 3D version is more expensive in most cases than the 4K. What do you guys think? Which one should it be more? It's hard to say. Uh, it's also releasing on a Blu-ray DVD digital HD combo pack, Amazon and Walmart $19.96, Best Buy and Target $19.99. Walmart this time will have an exclusive steelbook. The steelbook to me is just ugly and stupid, and uh, I don't think these Best Buy or Walmart steelbooks are really ever hard to find the first couple days or weeks, you know. So I, I wouldn't stress out too much if if you're a huge World Warcraft World of Warcraft fan and you feel like you absolutely have to have this steelbook, then I will get there. But otherwise, I don't think you're going to be too stressed out. It also is twenty two ninety six. So I remember if I said this, it's a Blu-ray DVD digital HD combo pack. On that one, Target will also have their exclusive version. It has like some art cards or something. And then Best Buy has an exclusive bonus feature. Bonus feature! Give me the bonus feature. <laughs> now, typically this isn't. Well, let's you know what? Let's go over the DVD real quick. Uh, DVD, Amazon and Best Buy sixteen ninety nine, Walmart seventeen ninety six, and Target seventeen ninety nine. So normally this would not be a movie I'd be after. And of all the movies releasing this week, it's the one I want the least. However, I would say a month or two ago, Target had like this crazy pre-order price of like $13 or $12.99 or something. And a lot of people were saying that it was just going to be like uh, canceled or you, you weren't going to get it. So it's like, whatever, I'll try it. Just 
I'll get the 4K for $13 or I won't get it. I don't care. I don't even want it. <laughs> and uh, it looks like he went through. I have, a, I have a tracking number and it says it's a 4K version. <sighs> so I guess I'm getting it. <laughs> but it won't be here till Wednesday, so maybe I'll have an unboxing for you guys up that on, on that on Thursday. Probably never watch it, to be honest. But All right, last up already. Yep, I told you guys a short one. We have... Mike and Dave need wedding dates, and I think this one looks kind of interesting, too. I actually haven't seen the trailer, but I saw who's in it, <laughs> and uh, that was enough for me. Uh, rated R, an hour and 38 minute runtime. This is an adventure comedy romance with a 6.2 rating. Two hard-partying brothers place an online ad to find the perfect dates for their sister's Hawaiian wedding. Hoping for a wild getaway, the boys instead find themselves out-hustled by an uncontrollable duo. <laughs> Zac Efron, Adam Devine, Anna Kendrick, and Aubrey Plaza. Whoa, it even has Steven Root. Or you might know him as Bill Doltrieb. <laughs> Anybody get that joke? Alright. So this one is, again, releasing on a 4K. Every movie this week, you know, for these major releases is a 4K. Uh, Blu-ray and digital HD combo pack. We got Amazon and Walmart at $25.96, Target at $26.99, and Best Buy at $29.99. A Blu-ray DVD and digital HD combo pack, Amazon, Best Buy and Target, $19.99, and Walmart, $22.50. It might come down to $20. That price is a little strange. And then a DVD, digital copy combo pack, Amazon, Best Buy and Target, $14.99, and Walmart, $15.96. So that's it for this week, guys. A couple of interesting titles, all releasing in 4K. And then we got Warcraft, which I will be getting for some strange reason. And I'll bring you guys that unboxing when I can. I'd love to hear about what you guys are after, if you guys have seen these movies, if you guys liked them or not. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, remember to give it a thumbs up. I would appreciate it. If you haven't already, subscribe for more videos. I'll see you guys next time.